to eight months ago. So we are back with another video. We are back with another travel vlog. Tiasha is here and today we are in Shelbyville, Tennessee. And we are heading to the nearest green distillery to try some Uncle Nearest Tennessee whiskey. So let's hop right into the video. Now, and those are pink 
by Miss Victoria. Okay. So if you guys want to go ahead and actually try it on the uh, I think we will master blend. Now, I'm going to put a little bit about our whiskey as far as being able to purchase it. Which one? When we started making whiskey in 2017, we wanted to go ahead and be able to release it. So the first thing that we released was our 1856, and that was in 2017. Now, whenever we were sourcing that whiskey, we were also running down our various prices. Now, the retail suggested value for the 84 is $50 before tax, the 56 is $60 before tax, and then the master blend is $164.61 after tax. Okay, now again, that was only available here, and it is the best of the 1884 at Facebook or Instagram. All right, y'all, I'm just popping in to tell you guys about my experience here at the nearest green distillery. It was so informative. The history that they gave was top tier. They were very knowledgeable in everything of the nearest Tennessee whiskey and whiskey in general. I'm very, very happy that I did go on this tour. Even if you're like me and whiskey isn't your thing, I would still suggest going because it was very informative and it was just a great experience overall. And if you don't want to try the whiskey, you don't have to try the whiskey. That was op optional. But of course, if I drove, we drove about an hour out to go to she Shelbyville, Tennessee. So I was like, you know what? Let's just have the whole experience. I'm in Tennessee and let's do this. And I'm so happy I did. I also bought some of the um, Uncle Nearest glasses and they were so cute. I'm so glad I did. They had a great little gift shop at the end and they had all type of knickknacks with Uncle Nearest on it. If you guys are in the area, I would say check it out. It is definitely worth it. Who is that? Who? Annabelle? This Annabelle right here? That's fine. That is not no Annabelle. Oh, that could be Annabelle. It's not Jack. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think that's Jack, Annabelle, Ben, Clay. Fine. Fine well, is the one that still works here, right? Mm -hmm. And runs everything now. Mm -hmm. I know that's right, Fine. <laughs> Get in your bag, Fine. <laughs> Okay, so now they have um, Barrel House Barbecue. They say it's real good, y'all. Real good. Yeah, I might have to see what that's about. Hmm. I love a good grilled cheese. What? <laughs> For clarification, what do you mean by that? 
So all throughout the tour, everyone kept talking about this grilled cheese, this grilled cheese, and I think it's called like a, a grilled cheese on crack or something. Ain't no real crack in it. We don't do that over here. But when they say um, crack, they mean the pulled pork, and it was on a grilled cheese, and it was so good. I was a little hesitant at first because of the name, of course, but then when I saw what was actually in it, I was like, yes. I like this and the pulled pork was so seasoned and it had like a barbecue sauce that was so sweet and oh, it was a sweet surprise at the end of that tour so if you go to this distillery make sure you guys try out the grilled cheese it is worth the hype so with all that being said that's gonna be the end of this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and let me know if you like little videos like this of me just trying new places and trying new things and I will see you guys in another video Bye.